keep collecting bucks I wanna what's inside Hello magical ones, it's JJ. Welcome back to my channel. This is my first video of the year and what a video to start on because I have with me the Keep Collecting box. Oh my god, it's finally here. Um, it has been a long wait. Um, I knew when I ordered it, it was going to be um, like four or five, maybe even six months because it was like a pre-order situation. But it's here and I'm so excited. I'm just going to get right into it because who can wait any longer? So when I open it, we just have a bunch of little wiggly things. Um, and we have a letter. Presenting your keep collecting box. The moment has finally arrived. I know. But please remember to feed and water your owl before sending it on its journey. I did. I gave uh, Reese some owl treats and he was happy as Larry. Speaking of journeys, the Wizarding Trunk and the Potter Collector began collaborating this box in February of 2020. Because we believe that character traits are of utmost importance, we sketched, planned, designed, selected colours, tested fabrics and searched for the materials and makers to bring you a character trait filled box. It is wonderful to see items come to life. Character, character, character. What more can I say about character? It matters. When all else fades, only our character remains. That is so true. Each practical, presentable and perfectly polished item in this box represents a house and a trait for which that house is valued. Thank you to the Wizarding Trump crew for their steadfast mission of quality, excellence and integrity in every process and product. My grateful heart goes out to the creative and hilarious roundtable brainstorming crew of Tim, Andrew, Nicole, Michael and Thomas. Kudos to Danny at Wizardry Workshop for his masterful skills in transforming concepts into graphic designs. And this resounding appreciation is for you. Thank you, Peter. As Potter Collector community members, Wizarding Trunk subscribers and fans of the Boy Wizard, you have modelled a contagious sense of patience, kindness and excitement as you wait for this box. Keep collecting from Peter Kenneth. Thank you so much, Peter. This um, letter means a lot. It's really nice to hear how much has gone into this. Thank you so much because your fans are so appreciative, including me. Now, what's this? Okay, we have an envelope. Okay, so first of all, I have a library card. Um, I hope that's gonna focus. Sorry about the light. Student must be in possession of this card to borrow library books. And I have access to the restricted section, which is pretty freaking cool. Um, oh, in the space for a little photo. Oh, sorry, the light is no good. There we go, so you can put a little photo. <gasps> Adorable as a bookstagrammer and just an all-round avid reader. I am obsessed with that and will be using it as a bookmark. Um, what else? <gasps> These are just, I love paper replicas. Um, it's a whole pass. Issued to blah, blah, blah. You can fill in all your details. Adorable. Hogwarts class schedule and look at the foiling I am obsessed so okay so on Monday we have charms from 8.45 till 10 then divination 10.15 till 11.30 that's nice that they've given you a 15 minute break to get to your next class that's very considerate if you ask me to Hogwarts with my little assortment of replicas. Okay, I see a pin, so I'm going to look at that. Oh. <laughs> it's the man himself, Peter Kenneth, the Potter Collector, or should I say Dumbledore. That's so funny. <laughs> and it's like he's 
Dumbledore's portrait and the, the look on his face is so regal and important. I love that. That is so cute. This little box is kind of heavy, so I might save that. We have something here. Thinks this is a Slytherin item. Whoa! That is so beautiful. It's the Chamber of Secrets. The the vault door that Harry has to open with Parcel Tongue, but it's a little coin collector. What do you call it? Piggy bank. It's a piggy bank. Or should I say a Snakey bank. No, we probably shouldn't say that. Um, this is really, really cool. I love all the detail. It's kind of um, mottled as if it's aged like brick. And these snakes are really, really intricate. I don't know if that detail is getting picked up, but wowza. obsessed with that. Okay, so what are the Slytherin traits? We have cunning, shrewd. I guess that could be either one, right? Okay, what's next? Let me get rid of all this. <laughs> the dragon hide gloves that Hagrid wears. Oh my god. Is so funny. I could garden in these. Um, they're also comically large, which is so fun. It's like they're literally Hagrid's. Tickled me. Okay, um, this has got to be Hufflepuff, right? I mean, I know how good was a Gryffindor, but I feel like gardening animals is more of a Hufflepuff. Unsure. Either way, it's <laughs> so funny, and I will definitely be doing some herbology. Another pin. All right. This is pretty clear what um, what trait this is because it's got it written right on the front. And this is a Gryffindor trait chivalry. What a beautiful and giant pin, my gosh. It says chivalry and then in Latin it says Persevero Collegendus. Um, I'm guessing that means something like we'll persevere together or I don't know, that was a guess. But that is pretty cool. I'll have to think about where I'm gonna put that. Um, maybe on a bag or something. Oh, there's something in a little green bag that I wanna open. It's a beautiful, um, almost velvety kind of material. Okay, I have received an award for special services to the school. <gasps> ah, that's so cute. <laughs> it's literally like a tiny little plaque. <gasps> I don't know what to say. This is so cute. Um, I could literally just like hang this up on my wall. Just get like a tiny little hook and just get my tiny little award. I'm obsessed. I wonder what I won the award for. Um, I'm going to say for being in the frog choir. Um, maybe I just gave a stellar performance because I don't really have that many other strengths. people 
to thank for this award. <laughs> um, Alright, I'm going to open this box now because I see another little box that looks cute and I might want to save that till last. Wow, this is a beautiful potion. Wit Strengthening Potion. Okay, so Wit, um, Wit Beyond Measure is men's greatest treasure. Okay, so that is Ravenclaw. Um, what are the ingredients? We have ginger root, armadillo bile, and scarab beetles. Wow, and it says potion use provides clarity to thoughts. That is so beautiful. And oh, look at that shimmer. Oh, okay, and it's even got the eagle here. It's not a raven, guys. It's an eagle and we have a bronze seal on top. So well done for book accuracy. Wait. Wait, what is this? Okay, I know what it is. It's the Sword of Gryffindor. But what? Is it a pen? It opens. Is it supposed to open? <laughs> okay. Okay, this must be the thing that I saw on Instagram that was like, if you don't know how to open it, you do something or other. This would be so embarrassing if I couldn't figure it out. Do you press the ruby? Maybe like the sword of Gryffindor, you have to be worthy to open this pen. <laughs> um, well, I'm not a Gryffindor, so that makes sense but a little disappointing. <laughs> no, I'm sure like, I'll just have to look up how you open it. So cool, just like such a cool item. I'm so obsessed with that. And I love to journal, so that will definitely come in handy. Now this is adorable, it's a little Quidditch trunk. Um, I need to see what's inside. No. No. <laughs> okay, it's. Is it a bludger or a coffle? It must be a bludger because there's two of them. Um. It's metallic, it's it's metal, it's quite heavy. Is it those, um, you know those balls, that, like relaxation balls, is it that? There's a little ring, so I think you would sit it on the ring. You can see all the little nooks and crannies. You wouldn't want to get hit over the head with one of these, let me tell you that much. That's so cute and you could display them in the little, the little Quidditch box. Adorable, such a cool item. We have some plain envelopes. And we have, it's cardboard. It's a Slytherin uniform. And it's got spots for creasing. Are these? I feel like these must be party invitations. Which is very sweet. Ravenclaw. Again, blue and bronze. Well done. Hufflepuff. And Gryffindor. Sweet. Okay, here is the cheat sheet. The lion, so that's the Gryffindors. We've got the sword pen. Lions are brave. That bravery was evident on many occasions when the sword presented itself to house lions. 
Use this sword pen with bravery. I'll try my darndest. The Medal of Chivalry Pin. Okay, so, all right, so the sword was bravery. The, um, the medal was chivalry. That makes sense. Then we had the badger. I was right, the dragon hide gloves are for the Hufflepuffs. And the, the what? Bowden balls. I was right, it's those relaxation balls. Used for relaxation and focus. The eagle. Oh, okay, so that was part of the traits thing as well, the school documents. Um, wisdom is the application of knowledge. Hungry for wisdom, eagles are eager to wholeheartedly engage in classes. Your class schedule, library card and hall pass should set you on the course to wizarding wisdom. Okay, it's all falling into place. And then obviously the wit strengthening potion was wit. And then we have the serpent. Uh, so the Slytherins, we had the service award. Oh, ambition of course. So the little tiny plaque was uh, for ambition. Serpents are ambitious and remain focused on achieving their goals. Some achievements are worthy of receiving rewards. Display your school service award with honor. I shall. And then we had the coin bank, which was resourcefulness, duh. I should have brushed up on my traits before this. Serpents are resourceful in difficult situations. The secret chamber is a clever place to save things for future purposes. This coin bank will help you plan for the future or provide a secret chamber for your valuables. And then we had the greeting cards. Okay, so they're greeting cards. Each house's stationery is represented in this collection. Who will you influence with your written words? Uh, any and everyone. Actually, no, I do pen palling, so I'll probably send some of those to my pen pals. And then we had the headmaster pin. Our favourite headmaster. Or is it? Wink. Uh, keep collecting. Wow. That was a varied and a thriller minute box to open. That was so exciting. There's, I mean, we had a potion. We had some useful items, we had the greeting cards, the relaxation balls, the pen, um, some pretty things, we had the chivalry pin. If I had to say what my favourite thing was, it's probably this award for special services to the school because it's such a prestigious honour. <laughs> I mean, it's so, just so sweet and um, I think they could have gone down the route of making this, you know, a, a pin or, or something like that, but they've just kept it as the award, as a plaque, but just in miniature version, which I think is so genius, and miniature things are hella cute. So, win-win. Yeah, that's got to be my favourite, probably between that and the potion because I don't really have any potions and um, it's really pretty. Like the blue color is stunning. I hope it's coming up on the camera. So yes, wow. Great box, Peter, and the wizarding trunk, well done. Thank you so much. I can't wait to um, open everything up properly and, and have another look. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my fun unboxing of the Keep Collecting box. If you've stuck around this long, feel free to like, comment and subscribe and I hope you're living your best magical life.